morning, we're giving you a preview of Art Meets Heart. Emily Deem joins us live from Green Bay to explain. Hi, Em. Good morning, Rachel and Pete. Hi, everybody. We are at the Art Garage this morning, which is really a great staple for the Green Bay community. They're going to be hosting an event coming up in February. It's called Art Meets Heart. Take a look at this beautiful mosaic behind me. It's filled with canvases. They have formed the shape of a heart. Each one of these canvases has either been painted on, drawn on, or even, check this out, three-dimensional. Tara Mortimer is here with me this morning with Art Meets Heart. She's going to tell us a little bit more about the event. Good morning, Tara. Good morning, Emily. What is Art Meet Heart all about? Art Me's Heart is one of the annual fundraisers for the Art Garage, um, and it's a combination of a community mosaic as well as a juried art show. Uh, we have a silent auction, and we throw a big party. We have a gala. It's happening February 2nd from 5.30 to 7.30. It's a really good opportunity for people in the community to come out and see what the Art Garage is all about. Well, let's talk about the people in the community because this is their work, a lot of those people. You're even one, and you told us, you know, this is your piece right here. You said, I am not an artist. So that's a lot of people doing this. Tell us about that. Right. We have, um, we have three-year-olds. We have grandparents. We have professional artists, all who have submitted pieces. And you can actually own one of these pieces by simply donating at a minimum of $25 to the art garage. You get one of these randomly selected and mailed to your home. And let's talk about randomly selected. Mm -hmm. and why the Art Garage chose that? We believe that every piece finds the right home um, and what people do is that they submit a statement with their art and they tell, they tell the recipient why they created their piece and what we've noticed in the past as we've done this is when people receive their random piece of art it just seems to find the right person. Now tell me, what do you really think this does for a community and bringing them together? I think that the community mosaic shows people that you don't have to be an artist. We have art classes here, we have art shows, so professionals along with beginners can kind of come together on a project together. And it's something really great to have even here at the Art Garage, which is a place that is nonprofit. So people coming together from the community, putting something on like this, and even to the gala that's going on in February. So everybody at home, mark your calendars because you don't want to miss that. Tara, thank you so much for being thank with you. us this morning. And you guys, coming up in the 7 o'clock hour, you're actually going to meet an artist of one of these, and it's a young kid, so you really won't want to miss it. All the information is at fox11online.com. Just click on Good Day Wisconsin. We'll send it back to you. All right. Thanks, Emily.